Hey, what up, dude? So, today what we're gonna do, I'm gonna do a little video on the top five fish that you should never eat, and it's not what you guys think. Also, check it out right here. We're doing a giveaway today. Pen Fierce 3000 right here. We're gonna give this bad boy away, so don't click off this video. I got him. You got him. You got him, Brent. You got him. Oh, 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 oh. The best mahi day without question. <laughs> Welcome back. So let's get started with this video. Top five fish you should never eat. Number one, and this is a fish that I grew up eating a lot. I've eaten it on my channel, but very, very in very small portions. And the reason I've eaten it in very small portion is because this is a toxic fish. It is loaded with all kinds of different heavy metals, and that is a king mackerel. Now, I grew up eating king mackerel guys. I grew up eating it all the time. And I made a video on my second channel, my vlog channel linked below, talking about my experience with heavy metal poisoning from, from King Mackerel. So go check that out if you haven't seen it, if you want to know what I went through eating King Mackerel. It is a proven fact that it has more mercury than just about anything that swims, which can cause extreme harm to your body. So yes, King Mackerel are a lot of fun to catch. I love catching king mackerel. I even like eating king mackerel. They're not that bad, but I choose to stay away from them because of the heavy metal poisoning. So fish number one, king mackerel, I would cut it out of my diet. Fish number two that I would cut out of my diet, any farm raised fish. And let me explain why. Farm raised fish have a very minimal room to swim. And because of that reason, they lose their color and they are actually given antibiotics and certain dyes in order to replenish their color. These dyes and antibiotics are full of toxins. Just be leery, guys. I'm just telling you, fish are toxic. A lot of fish are toxic. These farm-raised fish are no different. Like, if you're gonna eat salmon, try to get wild-caught salmon. Wild-caught salmon are not gonna be full of toxins. They're not gonna be full of dyes. They're gonna be a lot healthier for your body. Toxins wreak havoc on your body. It's a proven fact. I've experienced it myself. So if you want to stay clear of a toxic body, then stay clear of these five fish that I'm giving you today. All right, dude, so let's do this giveaway. Let's go ahead and get this out of the way right here. This Pen Fierce 3000. Uh, man, it is brand new in the box. And how we're gonna do it, it's gonna be super simple. Uh, so I, Yak Motley did a giveaway from his channel with the same reel last week. We're gonna do another giveaway. It's very similar to the one we did last week. And so what's gonna happen in order to enter this giveaway, we've already gave the, the first reel out to the winner. In order to enter in the giveaway, here's what you're gonna do. You are going to go to the link below. The link in my description is my channel. It's my new channel and it's my business channel. You're gonna to go to the very last video that I posted today talking about the lottery and you're gonna comment done under that video. So go comment done under that video for a chance to win this. Now, once you comment done, we're gonna pull you guys together in a pool and Yak Motley is going to announce the winner from his Instagram page. His Instagram page is Yak Motley. He's gonna announce the winner probably via Insta Story. So if you don't follow his page, you will not know if you won or not. So go check out Yak Motley's Instagram page. We're gonna probably announce the winner midweek, probably on Wednesday. So now that we're done with the giveaway, let's get on with the video. Fish number three. I have eaten these fish before. I ate them very, very sparingly. So I would never do it on a routine basis. Fish number three that I would not eat is a swordfish. Now a swordfish follows in the same category as a king mackerel. Very, very toxic. Uh, one of the most toxic fish that swim in our ocean, guys. Stay away from swordfish. They're delicious. I absolutely love swordfish steaks, but it's not something that I would ever recommend eating. 
Fish number four, and this is probably gonna offend some people out there. It's probably gonna make some people mad, but it is another very, very toxic fish that you should eat sparingly. Again, I've eaten all these fish, and I love some of these fish. I absolutely love the one that I'm about to name right now, and it hurts my feelings that I'm even having to do this. It hurts my feelings so bad. So, uh, but it's a tuna. Yellowfin tuna, blackfin tuna, bluefin tuna, they're all very, very toxic full of mercury and other toxins like that that are really unhealthy for your body so I would stay away from these fish I love raw tuna absolutely love it it's one of my favorite fish to eat but it is super super toxic so stay eat it sparingly that's all I can say I eat it on occasion but not very often number five dudes and this is something that I would also eat very sparingly and it's a uh, it's a shark and I've cooked plenty of shark on this channel. Shark is a really good tasting fish. I love mako shark, black tip shark. Both of those are really good to eat, but I would stay away from them because they're toxic. They piss through their skin. They, uh, you know, they're just a toxic fish. They're full of mercury. They're a bigger fish that's full of mercury, and I would stay away from them. I do like them. They taste really good, but again, this video is not about taste test. This video is about protecting our body from harmful toxins. So, yeah, shark. Eh, 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 eh. So, that's my five, guys. King mackerel, any farm raised fish, I stay away from. Uh, I'm also going to stay away from swordfish, tuna, and shark. They're all very there are other fish out there that are also toxic. I actually have a rule, and this is really, really interesting. You may find this the most interesting thing I've ever said on my channel because I've eaten so many fish on this channel. I've done taste tests just because I thought the taste test was interesting, but uh, I don't eat much fish. I don't eat, it's, I don't eat much fish. And when I do eat fish, I try to eat fish that are smaller than the frying pan that I'm cooking those fish in. And so uh, the smaller the fish, the less toxic they are, the better they are for my body. And that's what, the, and that's gonna give me fuel to go out there and accomplish the things that I need to accomplish on a daily basis. Dudes, if you enjoyed that video, shoot me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. You guys have a great week.